Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking and today we are back in automation and Beam NG Drive in order to test drive the 1994 Freshetta CRX. The most ridiculous car that Merano has ever built and it is and was an instant classic. An instant classic. Only few of this one were ever built, but man, it is a piece of that is difficult to handle or so I think we shall find out that is why we're here today let's say uh, let's see who um, the winner was here ah yes yes this was a very close one MGR 99 just barely lost to BF 94 what beautiful designs these were anyway we are going to take a quick look at the car in automation and then take it out to the test track. Yes, yes. A rather pretty car, isn't it? This is awesome. Uh, anyway, the performance is Ultegra-like. Oh, the fixture still had to settle. Now it looks even better. Um, the performance is Ultegra -like, uh, like we have even a bit more horsepower in this one 689 at 9100 a bit more refined that engine but the crux here is that it is not only more powerful than the Ultegra but also almost no not almost uh, 300 kilos lighter that is quite something full carbon fiber built this thing is just crazy. Somehow Merano managed to build a, a hypercar that is from 2010 uh, in 1994. We are quite proud of this one and it was not beaten by its, uh, or well, just barely beaten by its more modern prototype uh, cars, competitors that we tried to, uh, to build uh, to replace this one didn't happen it was just not much better than this car this is the pinnacle of Merano engineering and the design for it spot on awesome anyway uh, let's take a look at well this is 5.2 liter v12 and it's all forged and high-end components of course we are doing that at like a little stress there on the conrods but this car is not supposed to be driven that much and for, for that price it can come into the uh, into servicing once or twice um, anyway at 9200 rpm 9200 oh, 9100 rpm we have max power and then keep it pretty much steady up to 9800 this thing just revs to the moon okay uh, is there anything more no, let's head over and try to drive this in BeamNG Drive. And here it is, the Freshetta. Oh man, this is... Fuck me, this is looking like a... It's such a tiny car. It's a tiny car that is just a shell of carbon with a massive engine on it. And yes, it does look the deal. Almost otherworldly. Almost looks otherworldly a little bit, but still in Merano design. So pretty. All right. Yes. Everything working there. Headlights. Yes. Beautiful. <laughs> the the badge isn't glowing this time because it's uh, just the normal uh, the, the the normal thing. Uh, the, the normal badge, not the Merano badge, which has some material issues. And. How loud is it? That's another question. Uh, okay. Yes, very. Very, very loud and very good sounding. It's very Fruinian sounding. <laughs> it's not. Um, okay, I think we need to uh, give this a little test drive. Let's see how, how fast it is ex at accelerating. Because that is its main thing. It doesn't weigh anything. And it has more power than the Ultegra. So, oh, uh, don't don't jump on me. Eh? Are you guys ready? How fast will it be before the first corner? Let's see. I, should should I even brake? No, let's just go straight. 
straight into the barrier. Ready? And go. Oh! <laughs> 160. Uh, what? 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 What happened there? Where's my engine? Where? My engine is missing. Oh, uh, no, there it is. The drivetrain flew out of the front. <laughs> okay. So, um, problem. This thing is fast. Second problem. I, I don't know if I can drive this. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's go. Let's go a little slow. Uh, yeah, slow. Exa exactly. <laughs> and, and anything but slow in this thing. Oh, it feels almost feels slow. And then, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! As soon as you step on it, it just flies, flies you off the track. Holy shit! Right. That throttle pedal probably can't be used fully until the fourth or something. So this full throttle here. Whoa! Like maximum off. That was wheel spinning. Third, once you it's so much wheel spin that you're just moving crazily across the track. So well, just oh shit. There we go. Two oh this thing just keeps going. Oh, it could almost take the corner at ridiculous speeds, but just almost. Let's try again. Guys, please help me. This is, this is super difficult to drive. It has so much power. It just has so much power because it's so lightweight and has, well, yeah, no, no grip there. It's nothing that holds the power back. So fourth gear, when you shift into fourth, after you've revved out third, you're coming into fourth with wheel spin unless you're doing some some proper like be careful on the throttle and everything and then you just spin out and fall if you hit the throttle end. This thing just has so much power that I'm afraid to use it. This is like half throttle. Oh okay, yeah, full throttle. Full throttle in fifth. A little bit of brakes. 230. Yep. <laughs> okay, that works. And full brakes, full brakes. Oh, oh, yeah, I slowed down almost enough. No, I didn't slow down enough. Oh, that, it's like that shit. You get so fast, so quick. Like those brake zones are com in completely different places to all the other cars. I can happily drive this in fourth. It just has so much power. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ouch. Uh, it looks um, looks like a toy car from the other side, underside, but uh, so what, what What do we do with this thing? I can't drive this. I fucking can't drive this. 
How am I supposed to do this? Okay, at least the Bavarian bend is not the most difficult in this car. It's just, in general, it just goes everywhere on the track. And it just bounces around. As soon as you are on throttle, it's just bam, from side to side. Whoop! Oh, that wasn't good. Uh, from side to side because it's every little bump and unsettling of this it has so much power that it just shoots you from side to side. Holy shit. But maybe it is easier to drive in this view. I highly doubt it. But it's, it's better connected to what you're doing. So maybe, maybe that works. Maybe that works. Holy shit! Uh, fifth, fifth is safer, a little safer. But man, this is fast. There you go. Yeah, take it, take it. Oh, that, that's, that's not the road, get up. Give this thing a little bit of room. It needs breathing room. Alright, third, and a little slow. Oh, dirt rally. And on the front again. Ah, uh, where's the brakes out for this? Oh, it just moves around! It just moves around so much. Okay, good brakes though. Okay, I think I have to take it on. I think I have to take it on and drive this thing in a time trial. Man, oh man, this will be tricky. So, just to um, confirm here, I have it noted down. 1994 Frechetta CRX. Automation track time, 157.85. I'm happy today in this car <laughs> if I if I beat the Ultegra because that was a really really good lap on the Ultegra. Um, yes, the Ultegra was way easier to drive than this thing, and that's saying something. So uh, yeah, what I'm aiming for, 205. 205 would be great. I don't know how many tries that will take, but uh, let's aim for that. Okay, here we are on the start line. And first gear is ready. <laughs> let's see how this goes. Am I ready? No. <laughs> no, I, I'm not. Far from it. Ooh, okay. Here we go. probably not speak too much while driving this thing. Okay. So far so okay-ish. Probably shift into fourth here. Oh no, no! Oh fuck! Uh, I was... Ah. That was not me. That was not me on the front. That was the uh, stability control. We need to turn it off because this thing is basically undrivable with stability control. It's just way too aggressive. So it's turned off and ready to go. Here we have some acceleration. Yep. Yeah. And quickly around the first bends. Oh, that was beautiful. Careful, careful, careful. And open it up slightly. Don't go full throttle, now full throttle. Whoa, it just starts moving around the track again. And on the brakes. Wide, 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 wide. Can't accelerate yet. Now I can accelerate. And open it up. <laughs> Come on, steer. Yes. There we go. Oh, moving all over the track. Full throttle. Full. <laughs> now, 280. A little too fast around here. 230, better. Oh, no, 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 oh, 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 I caught, I caught it, I caught it, no, 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 oh, no, no, <laughs> uh, okay, the car is intact, the car is intact, let's revert to the start. Next try, please, here we go. Okay. 
So far so good. This is a decent ish start. Weird shifting going on there, yes, I know, but uh, it did its job. And quite fast out. Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. That movement. And down. And around ban him ahead. That was a much better line. Okay, third. 170 before Ke uh, Keswell's carousel. Can't talk! Man, this it's too taxing, this thing. It's just too fast for me. Oh, oh no, 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 no. There we go. Fifth. Now oh, we're safe. Uh, just break slightly. Oh, oh. Starts moving out the road. But yes. Oh, that was... That was damn fast. Okay, early breaking. Early breaking. Early breaking. And take it easy. Come on, steer. Yes. Third. Fourth. Moving all over the track. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shit. Oh. <laughs> a little too much braking there. Probably lost half a second with that, but... Uh. And... Can we keep it? Can we keep it on track? 150. We're in the right gear for the next corner. Because we don't want to... Oh, don't push yourself out of the corner. Now! Open up. Yes! Early braking for Cossack. Yeah. Come on, don't get so light. It starts to get so light on the wheels once you are on throttle. Okay. Easy, 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 easy. And open up! No, no, no! Shit! <laughs> no! Fuck! <laughs> we were on such a decent lap! Look at the time! Ah. <sighs> yeah, okay. Once again. Oh. Brief. Uh. Okay. Let's get going. Here we are. And go! And third, and take it easy. No, 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 no. Start again. Start again. That was too fast into the first corner. Can do better. And go! Yeah, that was better. That was a lot better. And steadily in third for all the next turns. That is good stuff. Good stuff. Fourth. Oh, that was a weird shift. Around. Brian's bend on the brakes. Decent speed through here. And open it up. Fly. Fly, fly. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I see a 174 there? That was good. And slowly accelerate. Ah. Fifth early, can't take this. Holy shit. Okay. Here we go. Careful around here. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, that was decent. Early on the brakes. Early on the brakes. Early on the brakes. This is still good. Still good. Okay. 107. Ah, beautiful. And third. Oh no 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 That thing is moving so much under acceleration from side to side every little bump just throws you off okay again here we go Yeah, so far so stable. So far so stable. And fourth and Brian's bend. Oh, oh that was that was a very high pace through there. Not intended. Uh, and that was a very slow pace for here. Also, not intended. 
Oh, stop it! Shut the fucking hell! Oh. Race that! Okay. There we go again. This shifting strategy does work. It makes it quite easy for the Evatsunesses. And decent out of here too. So keep it keep it controlled here. Tap on the brake. That is that is fast. That is fast. Need to need to brake at some point. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, that wasn't the cleanest. <laughs> That wasn't the cleanest. Holy shit, it's just moving everywhere! This thing is such a beast! Did you see that? It's jumping from side to side. Ah, uh, no! No! Ah, oh, man. Huh. This is a car that can... That has a skill ceiling that is way beyond this thing. So... And a learning threshold that is very high up. That's higher than automation. Yeah. Again. Oh, okay. Decent, decent. A little wide. A little shit. This is better. Slower. Slower, that's giving me a better line through here. More easily. Oh, uh, a little fast there. Come on, stay true to your line. Keep the front a little bit easy now. Oh. Yeah, that's much better. And bricks. Hurry up. Uh, 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 oh. Don't, don't, don't oversteer. Yes. Good, good. No, no, what? Oh, whoa. holy shit, this is just a horror show to drive sometimes when you want to drive it aggressively. And come on, Fit. I don't. I just can't do fourth over here. It's too much wheel spin. Alright, fast, fast, fast. Yes, that was very fast. And we're keeping up. Oh, oh, oh no, no, shaking. Woo hoo! Alright, brakes. Brakes, brakes, brakes. Slow down, slow down. Yes. Oh, come on. Yeah, 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 and third, fourth, and into the brakes. Stop, 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 stop. Yes. Okay. We made the, we made the turn just barely. Woo. Second. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Stay true to the line. 150. 60. Yes, 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 yes. This is looking good. Fourth. And take it easy for Cossack Corner. No, oh, steering, baby. Steering. Okay. Third. Towards the line, yes. There, that's just a scratch, yes. Uh, uh. <laughs> okay, mission accomplished. It was not a clean lap by any measure, but I did it. Frischetta, CRX, in two minutes, two, 41. Now I'm spent. Oh, uh, oh my god. Okay. Okay. Now, I want you to take this car and drive it around the track and give me a time quicker than a 202. I know you can do it. It's not easy, <laughs> but for me it isn't. But uh, I, I think some of, uh, some, some of you watching here are really good drivers and quite a, like a class better than, than I am. Um, not saying that that is very difficult, but... Um, Take this out on the track and see if you can break the two minutes because that is what this car is built for. You should be able to somehow do that. 
a skilled driver will have no problems with this whatsoever. I made so many mistakes in this run. Uh, so there's probably f five seconds easily in this. Um, yeah, I, I would like to hear if you managed to do so or not. Anyway, what a beast. This could easily be the fastest car ever built, period. It's like not for 1994, but just like <laughs> the fastest car built ever. Maybe there's something coming along like we built in uh, 2000, like 2015 or something, 2010, 2015, which is trying to beat this. But this one, just ABS, no help whatsoever, manual gearbox. Fuck me, this is an experience. I'm quite happy with how this thing drives and uh, like it handles pretty well. You see, see us going in there and like 280 kilometers an hour, braking into the slingshot at 240. That requires some solid handling from the car. It's just so unbelievably powerful that it jumps from side to side from on every little bump. I know I've said this so many times now. Broken record, Kilbrob needs to sign out. I hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time.